where we're at the bus. <laughs> Still sitting in the same spot as we work on it. Um, Nathan's finished a lot more of the flooring. Yeah, so all the flooring that is down is like 100% complete. It's glued to the floor. Um, and then people have been asking us like why we're not pulling the subfloor up and insulating underneath the hardwood. Um, I don't know if it's just because we have an older model or just because it's like a basic one or something. Um, but we have no subfloor. The whole bottom of our bus is just metal. It's the frame of the bus. So we voted on leaving the rubber coating on the floor because... So we're laying the wood floors on top of that. And then in order to insulate our floor, we're going to spray foam the underneath of the bus. And then we're going to do like a rhino liner or flex seal kind of coating on it to protect the insulation. Um, that's what we're going to do for the floor <laughs> just to make it a little bit easier. But I know we've been getting comments a lot on like groups that we've posted on and stuff. They're like, why aren't you taking up the wooden sub floor? We don't have one. <laughs> so that's a good thing about this bus. It's literally, it's just all metal. It's pretty simple. There's not a lot of hidden stuff in it. We still have done good. We haven't come across any rust um, or anywhere where it was leaking because we've been checking like the roof and behind like the insulation that we're pulling off. And luckily there hasn't been anything so far. We got a little bit of rain. That's why it's cooler today. But the only place that we seem to have water entry is just when we have our door not like fully locked shut. Um, other than that, we don't have any leaks, which is nice. Very important thing <laughs> to not have to worry about. Um, we kind of have our whole plan out for this. Um, is each week we're trying to dedicate towards a certain thing. Um, that way it kind of, for one, keeps us on track. Because our goal is to have this livable by December. I don't think it'll be 100% done to what we're wanting. But we will have like the flooring, the insulation. We'll at least have like the framing and stuff done. Um, to where we can stay in it at least for our room and then that way we can finish out our shower and our bathroom so those are the three big areas that we have to finish first um, is the shower the toilet room and our um, bed platform our insulating the ceiling we were just gonna keep the metal and then we really thought about with all that old insulation in there it was just better for our health and for the dog's health to just pull all that fiberglass insulation out